Our today's crime story is about the poet of death, Johann, Jack Unterweger. He is also known as the serial prostitute killer. He is an Austrian serial killer, who gave tough time to the investigation agencies. He was born in 1950. He was the only Austrian serial killer who committed murders in many European countries. Jack Unterweger was first arrested and convicted in a murder case in 1974. After his conviction he had been and put in the rehabilitation center. Soon after his arrest, he was released in 1990, as an role model of rehabilitation. He used this opportunity of being role model and he became a journalist and minor celebrity. But within a period of few months he started killing again. Jack Unterweger was from an unidentified father, he born in 1950 to Theresia. His mother was Unterweger, a Viennese barmaid and waitress. She did not know the father of Jack Unterweger and possibly an unknown American soldier. His mother met with the soldier in Trieste, Italy. According to some sources his mother is a prostitute, before Jack Unterweger's birth. His mother was also convicted for fraud and sent to jail, at her time of pregnancy. But she was released and she traveled to Graz, where Jack Unterweger was born. His motor was arrested again, and he was sent to live with his grandfather. Jack Unterweger started petty crimes when he was very young. He was in and out of prison during his youth for different crimes, and for assaulting a local prostitute. Within a period of nine years, he was convicted 16 times, most of crime sexual assault, and he spent much time in jail during those nine years. Jack Unterweger murdered, in 1974. Committed his first murder. The victim was an 18 years old German citizen girl. Her name was Margaret Schaefer. He murdered her by strangling her with her own bra, after sex. For this murder, he was arrested and sentenced to life imprisonment. In jail, Jack Unterweger used to wrote short stories, poems, plays, and an autobiography. Purgatory or the trip to prison, report of a guilty man, these were used as basis for a documentary. In 1985, Jack Unterweger emerged as one of the powerful figure in country. A, a campaign was started to pardon and release him from prison. In this campaign many well-known writers, artists, journalists and politicians agitated for a pardon, including the author and 2004 Nobel Prize winner Elfried Jelinek, Gunter Grass, Peter Humer and the editor of the magazine Manuscripta, Alfred Kollerisch participated. The Austrian president at the time, refused the petition when presented to him. Jack Unterweger get released from the jail, in 1990, on completion of 15 years imprisonment. Upon his Release, his autobiography was taught in schools and his stories for children were performed on the radio. Jack Unterweger himself hosted many local television programs discussing the rehabilitation of criminals. He also worked as a reporter for the public broadcaster ORF, where he reported on stories concerning the very murders for which he was later found guilty. Jack Unterweger was getting the status of celebrity, so he started his criminal life with more confidence. Jack Unterweger killed a sex worker named Blanka Bakova in Czechoslovakia, and seven more in Austria. During his good days, all the murders took place in the first year after his release, all of the victims were garroted with their own bras. Jack Unterweger was hired by an Austrian Los Angeles based magazine in 1991, and the differences between U.S. and European attitudes 
towards prostitution. During his stay in Los Angeles, three sex workers were beaten, sexually assaulted with tree branches, and strangled with their own braziers. On the other side the Austrian police was suspecting Jack Unterweger for the murders of sex workers. The police has no other suspect, so they decided to took a serious look at Jack Unterweger and kept him under surveillance until he went to the U.S. There was no clue to connect him with the murders of the sex workers. The Graz police finally got breakthrough and collected enough evidence to issue a warrant for his arrest. By the time Jack Unterweger had left the country, the law enforcement agencies chased him and his girlfriend, Bianca Marac, through Switzerland, France, and the United States, and he arrested by FBI in Miami, Florida, in 1992. From there he was shifted to Austria. The jury found him guilty of nine murders, and the pot of death was sentenced to life imprisonment. Without possibility of parole. In 1994, the same night he convicted, he committed suicide at Graz Karlau prison by hanging himself with a rope made from shoelaces and a cord from the trousers of a tracksuit, using the same knot that was found on all the strangled prostitutes. Kindly don't forget to subscribe and like our channel. Thank you for watching this video.